What's going on, everybody? This is your boy, the Bulldog, here. Gonna be playing some Uncharted Lost, the Lost Legacy. I have not played this game. I just bought it today from Walmart. It's been out for a while. I need to get into this. Before I get started, guys, I want to apologize for last night's stream. I was totally out of line and yelling and all that shit. So please forgive me, guys, for that. I already sold everything with George and Amy, so... Again, apologies for that. Um, before we get started, also, guys, make sure to like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell, and follow me on social media on Facebook and Instagram at Jonathan Layden, and on Twitter, Jonathan David Layden. Without further ado, guys, let's get started on Uncharted The Lost Legacy. This is my, again, this is my first time playing this. Really excited to play this game. <laughs> really excited. I also bought Uncharted 4, The Sand. So, I've beaten that one once, so we'll see how we do from there. And yes, it is close to midnight right now over here. Okay, let's get this thing started. New game. For some reason, when I bought this game too, I, um... I ended up, uh... The trophies were like 13% when I first got this game. I don't know why that was. Somebody actually played it before I did. I don't know. Alright, let's give this thing a shot. Um, lock on the camera assist. No cold camera assist. Sure, let's do it. Again, this is going to be my first time playing this, so let's give it a shot. Oh, I pressed the button. I just pressed that. Come on. Continue. Yes, please. Oh, I got a creeper seed. There we go. All right. Now, I don't know what the whole story about this is, but it'll be interesting to know as we check this thing out. I like the first four Uncharted games. They're really fun. Pretty difficult, but they're fun. Alright. Here we go. Ooh, I like the opening here. Very fresh, very fresh, I like it. Really dark game. Oh, okay, those are the one of the main characters. I saw her on the case of the game. Does it now? Half price if you buy two. Wow. You again. Is this your store? <laughs> no. My finest. How much? How much? 800 rupees, please. 800 rupees? Okay, okay for you. Buy 50. Incredible. So, does your father usually leave you here alone? No, he's away fighting the devils. Mm. The Indian army called him up today. No, he volunteered. Really? Well, if it was my choice, I wouldn't leave you here alone. All right, that's 300. 
Petita. 400 rupees plus Ganesh. <laughs> you don't want this. It's broken. See? You don't know the story? Ganesh thought Parashuram was standing guard at his father's door. Yes, to defend the honor of his father, Shiva, and got his tusk hacked off for his trouble. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Anyway, it's not for sale. Okay, look. 600 rupees. You can keep the change. Hey, wait! Hey! You need the guy. Oh? And what'll that cost me? <laughs> Yay. Oh, this game looks really fresh, guys. This really looks fresh. I like this. I love this. This actually looks awesome. Um, same, same exact graphics as the first four Uncharted games that I played. This is really fresh. Okay, so where am I gonna go to? I'm supposed to go somewhere. Oh. On that truck before it goes. Okay. So you're the mid. How much blood is it? Not for Not sale. Okay, so I'm supposed to get there. Uh, if you guys want to help me out, feel free. If you have played this game or started playing this, let me know your um, your take or I mean your um, knowledge on this game. I'd love to know how to get to this thing on time. <clears throat> what? Don't get me wrong. Decent technique on the lift. But I'd like my Ganesh back. Please. Fine. A for effort, kid. The one thing here, I know this is um, different from the Uncharted storyline. This is a totally different story. I'm not involving Nathan Drake, which sucks. Alright, there we go. Now we're in the truck. How's everybody doing? We're, I'm starting out playing... Uh, Uncharted The Lost Legacy. It's the fifth installment in the franchise. Really excited to play this game, guys. Really excited. There it is. Uncharted The Lost Legacy. Super excited. All right. What country is this, anyways? That's what's been questioning me. Guess I'll find out. I think I'm gonna end up finding out who, I mean, where this, okay. where exactly what country I'm in, because I have no idea. Chapter one, the insurgency. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's give this a shot here. Nope, nothing there. Okay. Guess we're gonna go waltz around, see what we can find. Okay, nothing there. Oh man, excuse me. Sorry guys. Just a little tired. 
I will sleep eventually. What the? Do I even have a gun on me? Oh, maybe I'm not supposed to go that direction. supposed to do something or okay what the hell <laughs> do I actually need to drive one of these vehicles uh Guys, let me know in the live chat here what um, if you guys know what to do here. Let me know. I'd be interested to hear your guys' take on this if you have played this game before. I'm just starting out. I'm just learning. So. I don't have any guns on me, so I can't shoot. Holy crap. Whew. Okay, so I can't get past there. Okay, I came from this direction already, so I should be come. I have to come out here. Okay. Oh gosh, this is, this is gonna take me a while to learn this a little bit. I'm still learning out. So I can't go past any of these guards, I guess. Right? Hey, hold on. What's your rush? How do I know you're not smuggling something in here? Arms off. Hey, hey. Dangerous to be out so late. Hey! Where do you live? What are you, deaf? Answer him! I said, where do you live? I'm in the middle of something. You've been late. Uh, yes, yes. Meet me inside. Understood. You, with me. Mandagan. Sir, what about her? Just let it be. You heard her. Get going. Get going. Get out of here. Whoa, okay, cheapers. Okay for them, I've got somewhere to be. obviously in the Middle East. I'm guessing this is taking place in the Middle East, like maybe outside of Israel, outside of Jerusalem, somewhere, maybe Syria. I don't know, but it sure looks like that from the looks of this here. Okay, there's a dead end. Oh, how you duck down? Oh, there you go. Yeah, that's right. You duck down like that. There you go. There you go. That's right. That's right. I totally forgot about that. They have the same game mechanics as the first four Uncharted. I'm really excited for this. If you guys have not played the Uncharted series, you are missing out. You're technically watching five, five, the fifth game 
when you are supposed to be playing the first four. So if you've not played the first four, you should be playing Drake's Fortune, then Among Thieves, then Drake's Deception, and then Thief's End, and then play this. Because this is the fifth installment. I've already played through the first one quite a bit. I saw my brother play through the second one. And I kind of, I think I did the third one as well. And I played through the fourth one. So I'm already caught up with the franchise. Okay, I think we're supposed to go this way. Oh, nice. Stealth attack. There's the red door. Nice. Rooftop. Lotus. Pink Lotus. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So I get to get to the rooftop now. Okay, we can't go that way. We gotta go this way. We got to get to the roof. Oh, there's the staircase. I gotta go around. Oh. Hey, hey, you there? You there. Damn it! So I'm supposed to meet this person on the rooftop. Where the hell is she? Dude. Look at that destruction, man. Holy crap. I'm supposed to wait up here. Oh, that's a, yeah, yeah, that's right. The Lotus. Duh. That makes more sense. Oh, dude, I love this. 
I'm loving this so far, guys. Yeah, this is pretty fun. Shift changed. Forget the roof. These two One was the warehouse, the other. You're in the wrong place, girl. What the hell? I've got you now. You're late, Fraser. I nice see you too. Holy shit! They took out the first squad! Stop them! <laughs> Damn! What the hell was that? I thought you were a professional. Oh, you should relax. I'll live longer. Relax? It took me to myself. The man's as unpredictable as they come. It's just another warmonger with no water fight. No, you don't know him, Lacott. He changes location and routines by the hour. We'd be foolish to take unnecessary risks. We? Let's get one thing straight. This is my gig. You want your share? We play by my rules. Oh. What's it gonna be? He's the one with the beard. That's the spirit. Oh. Mm. Handsome. If you're into psychopaths, nobody's perfect. Boys base camp. Top floor balcony. Street we all planned out. But they'll be looking for some. What do you see? I'll think of something. What's going on, Mako Campos? How you doing? Just playing some Uncharted The Lost Legacy. This is my first time playing this game, so come on. I'll give you a restart. Hope you enjoy the stream. This will be new for me, hopefully for you too. <laughs> If you have played the first four Uncharted games, feel free to stick around. And even if you haven't played the first four, you know, it's okay, you know, stick around anyway. You might like it. I'm doing good, you? Doing alright, Mako. How you doing tonight, buddy? It's already past midnight now. It's already four minutes past midnight over here in the U.S. I love the parkour and each Uncharted game has its own set of parkour, which is what I love. Up here. Really? Really. I have played this game and the first four and beat the whole collection. Oh really? You missing out. No, I'm not missing out. I'm not missing out, Mako. I've played through the first four. Man, I own the first four. Are you kidding? I hang on a second. Pause it for one second. I will even show you. I just bought the fourth one today. I beat it at my brother's. Yeah, man. I beat I beat it at my brother's then. Yeah, man. If you see. Right here. Uncharted, the Nathan Drake collection. I know, right? The games are amazing. There's Uncharted, the Nathan Drake collection. Um, I beat Uncharted 4 at my brother's friend's house. Yeah, man. There you go, Uncharted 4, Thief's End. If you can see that, there you go. I know you believe me, I'm just telling you, you know? And then there's The Lost Legacy. That's the one I'm playing right now. I know. I heard this is, I think this was the last Uncharted game that was supposed to come out, was Lost Legacy. This looks really good. Shit. Oh, Fraser? Is that her name? Fraser? How do you pronounce that? She said Fraser. I believe that's what she said. Up here. Really? Really? Oh, I want to climb up here. Oh, 
on this one. Are you sure this is safe? No. What's next after this, Uncharted? This is the Lost Legacy, and I think this was it. I think this was it after that. There's no more Uncharted games. I don't think there's any more. After this game, I think this was it. Come on. This way. Yeah, I don't think there's any more Uncharted games after this. Um, no idea. I have no idea, man. I don't know what to tell you. This is much more better. I mean, I prefer, I love Nathan Drake. I love Nathan Drake in the first four. Very well done series. What other games do I play? Um, I played Until Dawn. I play Until Dawn. I play VR games such as Paranormal Activity, The Lost Soul, um, PlayStation VR Worlds, uh, Rocket League. I have a I have a whole bunch of games. I play. Um, if you check me out, I also have a live stream called The Bulldog Show. Um, so if you ever want to check that out. Why am I the only one commenting? Well, because people are just here sometimes to watch, you know? Not everybody's here to comment. If there is someone else, there probably isn't. There's just people to coming in just to watch, you know? Don't hate, just appreciate. If they don't comment, hey, that that's their loss, you know. I don't I don't really care really if they don't reply. Okay. Oh, whew. dude, I can't go get over the sight of that destruction in the background like look at that man so how's your day been going ah it's going all right mate go hey how, how's yours been man you know we're just i'm just chilling you know we just chilling just chilling out man Oh shit, I shouldn't have done that. Okay. So now I know not to do that. Just exploring our options. Sit tight. Oh, you play Black Ops 3? Nice man. I own it too. I own Black Ops as well, man. Good game. Do I play multiplayer? Uh, occasionally, not too much. Not too much. I played a little bit. Not huge on the whole multiplayer thing. Is she not gonna come up? Like, what? What's going on? Come on, you. What are you doing? There's a crate, a crate. Right up there on the ship. Ah. Be right. Be right. That's where That's we need to be. But not getting through here without a uh, Okay, so we gotta go over there. So, Damn it. I really Okay, we can't go there. None of these characters do nothing. You have to do all the work. Oh, really? <laughs> well, that sucks. Uh, do you mind uh, helping me out a little bit, man? Mako, if you have beaten this game, let me know uh, what I need to do here. Yo, you should add me. Add you as what? What do you mean? A moderator? 
Yeah, I'm probably not gonna edge it as a moderator, man. Not yet, because I still need to get to know you, man. You know, but... Yeah, if you can help me out with this, dude, feel free. Uh, they said I gotta go over here to this to the Pink Lotus building over there. Go back, okay. Oh, I gotta go back up here. Behind. Oh, back up here. Behind. Yeah, I just came from the. Oh, there's the crate. Hang on. I think I found it. I found it. Found the crate. She was talking about. Shit. Oh, add you on PS4? Okay, what's your, uh, what's your, um, PSN, man? What's your PSN, Mako? What's your PSN, Mako? I'll add you, man. Yeah, what's your PSN, Mako? I'll add you, man. What's going on? Deeply disturbed. There's a gap in the door. The portal has been opened. Gap in the door. What are you referring to? Spider Boy BX. Okay, I'll add you in just a second, man. I'll add you in just a second. I got you. Okay, so I just came from here. I just came from there. The guy is right up there. See, I helped. Yeah, I know. All right, hey, I'll add you. What was it again? Spider box VX. Okay, hand. Oh, Spider Boy BX. Oops, my fault. One second. Spider Boy. Ah, I see ya. If at first you don't succeed, throw your controller. <laughs> All I get. I like your profile, man. If at first you don't succeed, throw your controller. I like that, man. I think that was you I friended. Let me know if I was right. <laughs> Deeply disturbed. Yeah, no problem, man. I got you, man. Okay, so... My fault. 
It's only my third time dying so far. Okay, maybe I am supposed to go there? Do I play Fortnite? Um, yeah, but not a lot. I don't play Fortnite a lot, man. You know what I'm saying? It's just above us. See, it wasn't so bad. It wasn't. Did you beat all the games? Bulldog, do you do star requests or do you lose focus with music? I just play music, you know, I just, I do song requests and sometimes I just do some music that I like, you know? Sometimes I'll dance to it, okay, so, doesn't make it a huge deal, you know what I'm saying? All I play is Fortnite and Black Ops 3. Oh, really? Cool. Cool. Song request, infected mushrooms. I'm 21. I meant if you did now. Uh, I'm not playing music right now, man. I don't play music right now, man. I'm game streaming right now. When I game stream, it's a different story. Yeah. I pretty much play anything, exactly. But I don't really play- there are certain games I sometimes don't play a lot of. One of them being Fortnite and a couple others. You know? What do you mean my other channel? There's only one channel I have. The other channel I have is... Okay. The other channel I have, I don't do anything really much on that channel anymore. That was my first old channel. This is my new channel. It's been around for three... This channel right here has been around for three years. I've been doing it for quite a long time. Yeah, um, yeah, we could stream sometimes. So we'll, we'll do Fortnite sometime, man. We'll do Fortnite. That's all right. That's all right. We can do that, man. No problem. We'll play Fortnite sometime. Oh, I get it. Okay, cool. Yeah. Yeah. This game is amazing. The graphics, the gameplay, and the action spot on. Oh, yeah. It's pretty much the same as the first few Art Uncharted games. Like, really. I think my favorite iconic scene from uh, Drake's Deception, Uncharted 3, would be the scene with the plane where you get knocked out of the plane. Remember that big tough guy you have to take out? If you guys recall that part. Deeply disturbed. Did you think he was playing music? Yeah, this isn't the bull. If it was the Bulldog show, I will play music occasionally. By the way, coming up, guys, will be my birthday stream. I'm just going to know my birthday stream is coming up. Uncharted 3 is my favorite. Yeah, man. I think so, too. I love Uncharted 3. The first one is alright, the one finding El Dorado, which was pretty interesting. The sequel, Among Thieves, was alright. 
I'm trying to remember each treasure. The first one was the El Dorado. The first. Hang on, we're, before we continue. The first one, the first Uncharted, Drake's, which was Drake's Fortune, was El Dorado. The second one was uh, Shangri La, or Shambhala, whatever they called it. The third one was Atlantis of the Sands. The fourth, these are all the treasures in each one that you had to go and find. The fourth one was the, um, but I don't really like how they put him like he can't do anything because he's old, but it was good. Well, they had to do that. Okay, Mako, they had to do that, man, for Nathan Drake because he is getting older. It makes sense if you think about it. With Soli, he couldn't do it either. And then with Nathan Drake, man, he was getting older. I mean, he's been through three games, man. And each game, it takes place year, certain years apart. And with him getting older, you know, he can't carry on his the whole entire franchise. And that, the, I know, but the way they did it was, eh, yeah, okay. I guess that, that's, a, that's your opinion. I thought it was really good. Otherwise... Oh, the shocking part, and again, if you have not played the Uncharted games, this kind of is a spoiler. The ending, where you find out that Nathan Drake has a daughter. Oh my god, like, you remember that, right, Mako? Like, I freaked out. If you if you know what I'm talking about, the scene where you saw, you find out he has a daughter. I'm like, wait, what? I'm like, no way, no way. Like, that's so cool. I like that how they, they left that for the end. And, like, she looks through the whole wardrobe of all the treasures he's collected through the four games that he collected in his collection. Yeah, I was like, man, like, what the... Exactly! I was, too. I was like, oh, my God. No way. No shit. I was like, I was really surprised to see that. Um, what was it? Elena? He's married to Elena now, the camera girl. The news reporter, whatever you call it. She's going to make a game of her own franchise. Yeah, I think so too. I hope Naughty Dog does something with that. I hope Naughty Dog does something like that with, with um, Nathan Drake's daughter. I hope they maybe start something off. I thought that was going to be in Lost Legacy. I thought maybe in Lost Legacy we were going to get that. But I guess not. Um... By the way, Naughty Dog is such a great thing when it comes to games. Speaking of Uncharted... Yes, I was just going to get into that. Yes, Mako, exactly. Exactly, Uncharted 1... Or, sorry, Last of Us 1, sorry. Last of Us 1, one of, if not one of the best games ever. I played Last of Us 1 on PlayStation 3. One of the best games ever made. I kid you not. It was like one of the best games I ever played through. It was difficult at some points, but then you managed to get through it. And the way they just left it at the end was like, ah, oh, no. Okay, now I have some ifs about the set. Okay, before we continue with Uncharted The Lost Legacy here, I need to talk more about Last of Us 2. Mako, if you don't mind. I do not like the trailer. I mean, there's one trailer I didn't like for Last of Us 2. And that was the scene where the girl comes up and they both kiss. Both, both, uh... Part 1 was amazing. Oh my god, yes. But... What, what was the girl's name again? That was the cure. In that, in that game. Her... Well, anyways. You know who I'm talking about. With her, in this one trailer I didn't like, I think it was from E3, and I didn't like it, was the scene where both of them are kissing together. Like, it's at a dance, or at some sort of party, and they're like, she gets drunk or something, and they're kissing. It's like, wait a second, is there gonna be like... Yeah, Ellie, that's her name, Ellie, Ellie, that's her name. But, it seems like her and this other girl are like lesbians. Yeah, exactly. I was wondering that too. Why is she lesbian? That is exactly what I was getting into. And I don't like the way Naughty Dog did that. I really don't. And I hope to God that's not the case. 
I hope to God she doesn't turn lesbian in this game. This is just going to be so weird. You know, I know it's going to be M-rated for sexual themes, language, violence, blood and gore, etc. But I really don't want to see her become lesbian. That's the last thing I want Ellie to become. You know? Joel lost his previous daughter in the first one when she was shot down and stuff. But I really don't want I really don't want her to die. I mean I don't want I mean not die. Um She did. She is. Did you see the Last of Us DLC? No, I did not play the DLC yet. No, I did not play the DLC yet for Part Two. Is it already out? Wait, is the DLC for Last of Us Part Two already out? She kissed her BFF. Yeah, I saw that in the trailer, man. I saw that in the trailer. Oh God, if she is, I'm not probably gonna play it. Oh yeah, she kissed her boyfriend or some in the first one. Yeah, I know. I'm talking about part two, man. But I swear to God, I'm probably not gonna play it then if that's the case. That's probably gonna ruin my experience for Uncharted. Or I mean for Last of Us Part Two. I don't know. I'll play it, but I'm not gonna be too I heard from reviews. I even heard from reviews myself. You mean she kisses another girl? Oh, wow, okay. Well, no, I did not play that DLC for the first one. No, I didn't. But let me just tell you, though. Other than that, I might not play it. But I might not play number two. I'll play it. But let me, let me get something straight. I was going to say this earlier, too. I heard from reviews online, Mayo. So she's lesbian in The Last of Us 2. She's more open. Okay, Mako, hold that thought for one second. Let me finish what I gotta say. Um, from what I heard from reviews for Last of Us Part 2, I heard it's not as great as the first one. That's the only thing I've heard. It's not as great as the first one. Right now, they're only 60% done uh, with making the game before it's released next year. Uh, the release date they say is like in July or something. Why do you have something against... Let's, I don't have something against lesbian people, okay? This has nothing to do with that, man. Okay. Okay, Mako, you're taking this the wrong direction, man. I'm just saying... I, this is what I'm hearing, okay? And this is sometimes this is some things why I think. I didn't say I was against lesbian people, okay? Maybe I am, maybe I'm not. But then again, you know, you don't want to see that in a video game, man. I mean, I understand. Lesbian is totally normal. Fine, okay? But the fact that there... I'm just saying that... The gameplay looks good. The graphics look good. Okay, those are the positives. The negatives are... I don't know if it's going to be as great as the first one because sequels don't always live up to the first installment before them. And, um... Again, like I'm saying... You know, yeah, I know. That's reviews. That's what you think. Okay? I'm just saying my own take on it. Okay? This is all my opinions. Okay, don't hate me for my opinions. I'm just saying what I got to say out, you know? So don't, please don't be hating on me, Mako. I'm just saying what I'm, I have to, what I want to get off my chest. So, it is a nice collection, I must say. Yeah, try, try not to take offense. If I'm, because I'm just getting my own take out. Everybody has their different opinions. You're working for a thief. Again, I don't think, like I said again, I'll say it once, one last time. Last of Us 2 might not live up to the first one. Yeah, I mean, you know, but it's good that they did that because people are mean 
towards gay people or lesbians. Well, again, I'm not really supporting that kind of thing. You know, I don't support gays or lesbians. No offense. I'm not one of those people that supports the genders of gay and lesbians or homosexuality. I don't do that. You know? All right. I'm just I'm just letting you know, you know, this, this is my take on things, you know. I'm a Christian person, you know. I, I, I was raised in a Christian family. Um, I still go to church, you know. I I I believe in Jesus Christ, you know, as my Lord and personal Savior, you know. So it's like, you know. Again, I have, I don't, <laughs> I don't hate the people who are like that. It's just I don't support them or anything. They can do whatever they want, I guess, but I don't support them. You know what I'm saying. So, but the, again, this, this, we're taking the topic, we're taking it off topic when we're talking about lesbians or gay people. Okay, I know it had something to do with Ellie becoming a lesbian and opening herself up in number two. But I don't really want to see that in number two. That's just my take. I know it'll probably happen. Exactly, exactly, Mako. Exactly, man. Um, okay, let's move on from, from, from Last of Us Part 2. Let's talk about another game. Let's talk about another game. Actually, two games I'm excited for coming out. Do you mind? Let's move on. Let's move on to two other games that I'm excited. Move to. Before we continue this, I'm sorry. I, I need to talk about two other games here. Um, first one, I already pre-ordered. I feel you, man. I get it. Yeah, man. Well... Okay, so the first game I'm excited for mostly coming out on September 7th is Spider-Man. And I've already pre-ordered it. I pre-ordered the Standard Edition. I'm really excited for it. I saw the E3 trailers. It looks awesome. I'm really excited for it. I can't wait to own it. I'm, I'm, I am I'm. pre-ordered. I got to put in, pay a $60 tax or some of that. Yeah, man, go ahead. Oh, yeah, Did, are you going to get it? Did you pre-order it, Mako? Did you pre-order Spider-Man yet or no? Anyways, if you haven't, please make sure you do that, man. If when, if you can. You know, I've already done my part. I've already pre-ordered it. I'm already going to be getting it straight from GameStop when it comes out. So, um, another game that... I can't wait for Black Ops 4. Ugh! Ugh! Please! Don't mention Black Ops 4 in my face. Please. I respect that you love Black Ops. That's cool. Not the type of game I'm into. Battlefield 5? I'm not sure. I own Battlefield 4. That's it. But... Yeah. I, I can't get into... I, I'm not really excited for Black Ops 4 in my opinion. That's your opinion. If you like that, that's cool. I totally respect that, but you know, again, when you think about that, I just, I don't, just don't know. The um, oh, right about that. And one, um, one other game, one other game that I'm excited for, guys. I will say it real quick too, is uh, Kingdom Hearts Three. If you are familiar with the Kingdom Hearts franchise, Mako, have you played? The 1.5, 2.5 HD Remix, and 2.8 Final Chapter Prologue. If you played all those, um, you should be all set for Kingdom Hearts 3 coming out on January 29th of next year. I like hard copies. Yeah, okay. Don't pre-order a lot. Oh, no. No, I don't pre-order a lot, man. But no, Kingdom Hearts 3, I'm really excited for. If you If you don't know what Kingdom Hearts is... Or if you're not familiar with the franchise, just let me know. Oh, you want that too? Okay, so have you played 1.5 and 2.5 HD Remix and 2.8 Final Chapter Prologue? Because if you have, you should be all set for Kingdom Hearts 3. I'm only a few games short of completing everything right now. I'm all, I, Right now, all I need to play is the rest of Birth by Sleep. Then I gotta play Fragmentary Passage, Dream Drop Distance, and I gotta watch Back Cover. And once I'm done with all of them, then I'm all set. So I'm only four things short. 
Okay, well, if you're going to get Kingdom Hearts 3, man, I recommend you start with the 1.5, 2.5. Start with Kingdom Hearts 1. Then I'll go all the way through Chain of Memories, 358 slash 2 Days, Kingdom Hearts 2, Birth by Sleep. Do all that, and then go into 2.8. Once you finish 2.8, then you're all set. You're already there. Okay? So, First, yeah. I mistook you for just... So yeah, make sure you, you do that before you play Kingdom Hearts 3. Because if you just if you're just gonna jump right straight into Kingdom Hearts 3, you won't even understand the franchise. Man, you gotta you gotta watch you gotta do it from way at the beginning. I would recommend you start with Burp by Sleep. If anything, Mako, here's my recommendation to you. I would recommend you play Birth by Sleep first before playing KH1. Before playing Kingdom Hearts 1. Then going into Chain of Memories, and then going into 358 and Kingdom Hearts 2. That's how the franchise was supposed to go. And then after that, then you play Dream Drop Distance. Then you play Fragmentary Passage. And then you play Back Cover. Don't worry about Recoded in 1.5, 2.5. Don't even worry about that at all. You should be okay. Yeah, that. And um, another game I might get eventually, maybe I might pre-order... As well is um, WWE 2K19, which I might get. I wouldn't mind getting that. Alright, let's get back into this game here. Three Persian invasions, three separate wars, and all these years later, no one has found it. We're close. You're lost. And the only chance you have of even narrowing down its location is to find someone who can help you crack this artifact. Someone with an extensive knowledge of this sort of society. Exactly. An expert. Me too. In history. My rates are reasonable. Okay. Uh, me too. I played 12 all the way to now. Oh, oh, you're talking about w oh, WWE 2K12 you played? All the way to 2K18? Nice, man. I have 2K17 and 2K18 of WWE. I have 2K17 and 2K18. They're good games. So that's a no. Yeah. I like that. But I don't need any more so-called experts. Shoot them. Throw their bodies in the river. No need. We'll throw ourselves out. After that! Help me! Through the window! Oh, shit! Come on! We need to get a pair of cars! Oh, dude. <coughs> Resident Evil 2, or is that Red Dead Redemption? Oh, shit. Hang on, I gotta concentrate on this part. I can't wait for RE2. Which one's RE2 again? Is that Red Dead Redemption or... Or no, that's not it. It's probably Resident Evil, I don't know. Resident Evil 2? What do you mean? They're remastering that now? Effective. You were going to sell me out, weren't you? It's called improvisation. 
God, who's being unprofessional now? What the hell is that supposed to mean? It means you let Asav get the jump on us. I'm starting to wonder whether you're worth the 50%. I know, but when are we gonna get you our guns? Get the never can't change your spots. You know nothing. Oh man. Fear warning. Woo. Last person who betrayed me wound up dead. Yeah, you didn't see yeah, the E3 trailer. Me. They're remastering it. No, I did not see that. Well, time to go. Oh my god. Ooh. I love all this parkour. Oh shit. Look up RE2 Remastered E3 trailer. Okay, I'll look it up. I haven't even played any of the Resident Evil games. I never played any. Can't jump off the building like that. Are you joking? Let's go, man. I'll be here next time. Okay, man. Take care, man. Go. Thanks for stopping in, buddy. Have a good night. Stop dying. Follow me. Never just below. Slide down the line. Here we go. Epic fail. Sit in the water. Yeah, we made it. Hmm. How are we going out there? On schedule. Should hit landed about a minute, right? Oh, finally, they're in their outfits. Tusk of Ganesh. The red shirt and the gray shirt, nice. No wonder the whole solar capital was ransacked. Look at this thing. Any luck? I don't need luck. I'd say we can use all the luck we can get. Are you still hung up on Asav's so-called expert? Don't worry. But if Asav's not in the gets already, he'll be right on our heels. Plus, he's got weapons, transports, hundreds of men. Like I said, don't 
don't worry. <coughs> Maybe. Let's see. Okay. The trident was Ganesha's weapon. The bow and arrow was Parashurama's. And the axe was a gift from Shiva. What kind of treasure is this battle. one? What? The battle in which Ganesh lost his task. I bet we find these symbols. We find the task. Oh, bad, Fraser. Yeah, well. You like my dad for that Hindu myths were his thing. Might have rubbed off. You must be proud. Some sound less though. I'll go get ready. Nice work. A lot of good parkour so far in this game. I like this. And within the first chapter, I think we were on the first chapter or the second chapter. Oh well, it'll tell me. Look at that beautiful, beautiful graphics right there. Beautiful graphics, Naughty Dog. Nice job. Nice job on this game. Oh my God, this is beautiful. Look, how weird. I'm sorry, my daughter did not. Right. I'll do this for a little bit more guys a little while a little bit a little while more and then I'm probably gonna cut it cuz I need to get some sleep soon you don't like it no we've gone nearly a hundred kilometers with no sign of assault the last half full maybe we got the jump on them unlikely I'll find the task <gasps> oh it's all coming back to me now that woman right there, she was in Uncharted 2 Among Thieves. If you guys have not played Among Thieves, she was one of the women who betrayed Nathan Drake. I believe that's her. The one that worked for the bad guy. And then at the end, she ends up working for... No, at first she ends up working for Nathan Drake. Then she betrays him. Ends up working for the bad guy. And then asks to be back on his team towards the end of the game. Yeah, it is her. Oh my god. No way. Yep. Chapter 3. Homecoming. Nice. <laughs> Spider-Man Homecoming. Just kidding. Show off. on it I'm fine by the way <coughs> okay Yeah, give me your hand. I'm good, actually. Okay. <laughs> I'm good, actually. Nope. I don't mind. I do. It's a control thing. Sure. Finally, we get to drive. Let's just enjoy the serenity, shall we? Got a dumb question. Not much for that. How do you know the tusk is still there? 
It would have turned up in a museum or something by now, right? Plus, I haven't seen any Hoy Solar <coughs> I've never even heard of the Hoy Solar before this job. Yeah, well, that's the fault of their last king, really. Young, reckless, flaunted his empire's wealth, built a new capital to help with us. And then led the Persians right to their doorstep. And now us? And now us. Hmm, Give me a second. I can wait. <laughs> It's like, well, let me do that. Oh, I do know how to go this way. Hey, look, Flamingo Convention. From the city? Quiet. Quiet. You come back here often? No. Not really. Poisson are ruins. When you get to that gate, I'll check it out. <laughs> what have we got? What have we got? Halibut and Balor. I thought these were Ganesh and Shiva. Someone's been paying attention. Ganesh was the guardian of Halibut. Oh, hang on, I'm gonna go get a drink, guys. I'm gonna
going on this again? Newer. Newer. the horse of the Well, the stone is beautiful. But this isn't much of a defensive one. Mm. Sculptors' quarters. I don't like them. We're still on the outskirts. Didn't take you from my brother. That would be that my dad, actually. I'm just a thief. Hey. Hey. Hmm. The rental equipped for the winch. Looks that way. Great. I'll make short work of these gates. What, you're just going to pull them down? That's the plan. Unless you've got dynamite. This is your gig. Take that as a no. when it comes to Indian runes. Sentimentality in this line of work? Get you killed. Um... <clears throat> It's brought a whole battalion with him. Might even be more inside already. Hey, I'm flattered that he's taking us so seriously. 
Alright guys, I think I'm going to call this guys. I know this is a bit shorter than usual, but uh, there you guys have it. We get a little taste of Uncharted The Lost Legacy. There you go. I'm going to call this tonight guys, because I need to get to bed guys. I'm too tired. So I'll catch you all on the next one. Make sure to like and subscribe. Ring that notification bell. Follow me on social media, on Facebook and Instagram at Jonathan Layden. And on Twitter at Jonathan David Layden, everybody. And I will catch you all on the next live stream, on the next game stream. Or, um, and I said this when I wasn't streaming. Uh, the Bulldog Show will be back probably on, not tomorrow, it will probably be on either Monday or Tuesday. So, look forward to that then, guys. It'll be at, I think, 7 o'clock at night, 7 o'clock Eastern Standard Time, um, at 7 p.m. So, anyways, guys, thank you all for watching. I'll catch you all on the next one. Remember... Be cool, stay awesome, and be like me, the Bulldog. You know, your number one streamer. Take care, guys. Have a great night, and God bless. Peace out.